I'm gonna show you exactly how I unlocked my stock BMW exhaust to make it much louder. But first, I have a little bit of a confession to make. This isn't a stock BMW. When I first bought my M2, I expected it to be a bit louder. So I went ahead and did a bunch of modifications to make it really loud. But not everybody wants to do these kinds of mods, which is exactly why I haven't put Catalyst downpipes and a tune on my X5M yet. Instead, I did some research on how to make my BMW louder without affecting my warranty or having to cut my stock exhaust. Here's what I found. When our BMWs are in sport mode, the exhaust flaps are open. Thing is though, they don't stay open. Depending on how much gas you're giving it, what gear you're in, and what speed you're going, the valves are either open, closed, or only partially open, meaning they don't get as loud as they could. But there's actually a way to keep them open all the time, meaning a louder exhaust and some crazy cold starts. And the best part of it is that it's 100% safe for your car and it will never throw any check engine lights or anything like that. But there is a special way to do it, so make sure you watch these next steps really carefully. Start your car and let it warm up for a minute or two and then put it in sport. And once it's in sport, you should see the valves open. If they don't fully open, what you can do is get a friend to rev the car a little bit and then they should be fully open by then. Unfortunately, on some exhausts like mine, the exhaust flaps are so far in that you won't be able to see them through this pipe. In this case, you're gonna have to listen to them. Once the flaps are fully open, reach over to this plug and disconnect it. To get the connector off, all you have to do is pry this tab up a little bit and then you can pull it straight off. Once you have that disconnected, do the exact same thing on the other side. And then once both sides are disconnected, you can turn the car off. And then it's really important to make sure that you wrap up the connector or else a lot of dirt and stuff can get in there and it won't be good for when you want to plug it back in. And now we're all done. Our exhaust flaps are going to be fully open all the time and our BMWs are going to sound a lot better now. So if you ever want to reverse it, just put the connector back in. That's why it's important to keep them clean. Anyway, since my BMW is going to be louder now, let's go for a little drive. <laughs> What I first noticed is that my car is louder in the places that it used to be quiet. What I mean by that is that when I was reversing in the past, the car's valves would close and it would be quiet. When I was idling, it would be quiet. But now you can actually hear the downshifts. You can hear the exhaust growling and rumbling when it's reversing. And you can hear it sounding crazy on idle. And now it even pops. I've never heard this exhaust pop. Another thing that I noticed is that it's louder on the highway. Before, I think even if you're in Sport Plus, which I always am, I think it would close the valves on the highway. One thing that I did notice though, is that when you're doing regular pulls, it isn't really that much louder because, I mean, it's already probably having the valves open fully but it's still louder overall. What else is there, Daryl? Did you notice anything? Deeper growl. Right, so the exhaust is deeper overall. Yep. I honestly really like this and I'm gonna be keeping my exhaust valves disconnected. If you're thinking about doing this, I totally recommend it. See how you like it. If you don't like it, you can always put them back on. And like I said before, it won't do anything to your factory warranty or cause any problems at all. With that being said, if you wanna hear more of my super loud M2, <laughs> that you saw earlier on in the video, click this video right here.